The mission of the United States Air Force's 480th Intelligence Wing, headquartered at Langley Air Force Base, Virginia, includes operating and maintaining the Air Force Distributed Common Ground System, DCGS, weapon system. The DCGS mission provides joint warfighters near real-time, actionable intelligence derived from multiple intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance sources. Individual Distributed Ground System, or DGS, sites simultaneously receive data from multiple airborne, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions. Personnel analyze that data and provide intelligence information to combatant commanders and their ground combatants around the world. Historically, this mission has been performed with equipment housed in ruggedized, deployable shelters. Transformational communications technology and warfighting concepts have enabled DCGS units to conduct combat operations from their in-garrison positions. Modernization that allows operations within an office-type environment and the expansion of the weapon system to accommodate the ever-increasing demand for intelligence data requires larger fixed facilities at Langley Air Force Base and Beale Air Force Base. These new state-of-the-art facilities will allow DGS-1 and DGS-2 to continue meeting the warfighter's increasing need for intelligence data. Facility requirements to support new and future generations of this weapon system on which the DCGS mission is based were identified during earlier studies that formed the basis for programming MILCON projects currently underway. The key facility requirements include the following. Interoperability between geographically separated DGS sites is critical to support contingency operations and to ensure personnel moving from one site to another are easily integrated. Reliability of mission-critical systems is essential to ensure continuity of operations. Facilities must be flexible and adaptable, promptly reconfigured to support future technology upgrades and evolution of the mission. Facilities must be able to be readily expanded if additional missions are required. Two current MILCON projects demonstrate the 480th Intelligence Wing's commitment to realizing these goals for facilities serving the DCGS mission. A new building currently under design will house DGS-1 at Langley Air Force Base, Virginia, and an existing facility at Beale Air Force Base, California, will be expanded with a similar footprint to portions of the Langley facility. Each site has a similar template and common infrastructure platforms to facilitate interoperability. The nexus of each facility, housed within a sensitive compartmented information facility, or SCIF, includes an open, reconfigurable operations floor. The ops floor workstations are fed directly from the mission communications server room. The mission communications room is located directly below the ops floor. This proximity minimizes cable runs between spaces and optimizes connectivity and flexibility. Flexibility and the ability to rapidly reconfigure systems are essential facility requirements to support DCGS operations. Therefore, the facilities are designed to accommodate rapid technology churn through use of system support space to allow for a transition of equipment through reconfigurable operations, floor and mission communication spaces and through layering of building systems in interstitial spaces. An overview of the DGS-1 design for Langley Air Force Base demonstrates key concepts used in each of the facilities. The new 144,500 square foot complex will bed down the modernized Air Force DCGS weapon system at Langley Air Force Base. The complex includes a 122,000 square foot operations center with 100,000 square foot skiff and a separate 22,500 square foot maintenance and storage building. Construction of this new facility will enable ongoing operations to continue throughout construction and commissioning. This facility will support a total of approximately 800 personnel assigned to the facility, with typical daily shift personnel occupancy of approximately 450 personnel, mission dependent. The SCIF portion of the facility accommodates approximately 600 assigned personnel and includes a flexible, reconfigurable operations floor that will serve up to six simultaneous missions, supported by a mission communications room with up to 120 server racks. 
Segregated observation and work areas will be provided for visitors to the skip. Both the ops floor and mission command can be expanded into other areas of the wing if additional space is required. The operations floor and mission communications facilities will have a raised access floor, overhead cable trays, cable ladders, and extensive communications infrastructure for maximum reconfigurability and connectivity. These facilities are the focal point of the DGS-1 mission. Additional administrative and maintenance space will accommodate approximately 200 personnel, including command functions for the 497th Intelligence Group, 10th Intelligence Squadron, 30th Intelligence Squadron, and Detachment 2 192nd Fighter Wing of the Virginia Air National Guard. Open office planning will optimize future use of the building, allowing easy expansion and contraction of various functions as needed. Core functions, such as restrooms, copy, and break rooms, and building services areas are located near the center lobby area to facilitate future expansion of the building at the end of either wing. Space has been reserved for construction of additional wing space. Site work includes provisions for standoff distances and other anti-terrorism construction standards, firefighting access, parking, exterior mechanical and electrical equipment yards, service roads to loading dock and mechanical equipment areas, and landscaping. At Beale Air Force Base, DGS-2 will construct a 90,000-square-foot skiff addition to an existing 548th Intelligence Group headquarters to house the DGS mission. Like the Langley facility, the centerpiece of the operational areas includes a 12,000-square-foot operations floor located directly above a 6,000-square-foot mission communications room, surrounded by open office suites. Core functions are centralized near the skiff lobby, to allow for future expansion and reconfiguration of office areas as needed to support the mission. The DGS-2 facility will house elements of the 48th Intelligence Squadron, 13th Intelligence Squadron, the 9th Intelligence Squadron, and the 234th Intelligence Squadron of the California Air National Guard performing the DGS mission. The investment made by the Air Force in these DGS facilities will provide structures suitable to meet the technology demands of the 480th Intelligence Wing, DGS-1, and DGS-2 for the foreseeable future, with tremendous built-in flexibility to adapt to changes as needed.